Welcome to Conspiracy Thursday. What's the connection between CAA and the New York Knicks? Creative Arts Agency, or CAA, is one of the most influential entertainment and sports agencies in the world, managing dozens of clients across the NBA. One of their clients, Jalen Brunson, recently signed a four-year, $104 million contract with the New York Knicks, where his father is also a newly hired assistant coach. Brunson should make them formidable enough to win a play-in game or two, but it's the connection to CAA that made this happen. That's because they've been running the Knicks for at least a decade. Executive VP, World Wide West, has been a shadowy NBA power broker and CAA consultant with ties to Kentucky basketball and the Knicks for two decades. Team president Leon Rose was formerly Clutch Sports founder Rich Paul's boss. CAA's tentacles have only grown since Rose and West were hired. The Knicks' strategy to use their CAA connections to lure star players has not been as successful as they anticipated. Julius Randle, a longtime CAA client and former Kentucky Wildcat, opted to sign with the Knicks in 2019. Head coach Tom Thibodeau is also rep by CAA. The Knicks have been connected to Brunson and Donovan Mitchell, both CAA clients, since last season, sparking rumors that Mitchell would also wind up as a Knick. That hasn't happened yet, but CAA's Knicks connections have run deep for years, leading Knicks players and other teams to complain about their interference. The trio of Wes, Rose, and Randall were seen at Game 1 of the Jazz and Mavs playoff series, which reportedly angered the Utah Jazz. Unfortunately, the Knicks have found themselves living in a clutch sports world since Rich Paul and LeBron spurred the CAA Knicks in 2010. Not long afterward, LeBron left his agent Leon Rose and CAA to form clutch sports. Worldwide Wes and Leon Rose are about to give frustrated Knicks fans blue balls and free agency by throwing a bag at Jalen Brunson instead of a genuine all-star, and you can thank CAA losing the clutch sports war for that. Thanks for watching, and stick with Deadspin.